Indiana Motorcycle Permit Practice Test 5 Question 1. In order to cross railroad tracks safely, you should cross them at an angle of at least degrees. 20 120 45 90 Answer 45 Question 2. How can you warn the driver behind you that you are about to slow down? Slam on the brakes. Turn around and make eye contact. Wave your arms. Flash your brake light. Answer Flash your brake light. Question 3. The majority of motorcycle crashes occur in curves, at high speeds, at low speeds, on hills. Answer At low speeds. Question 4. If you can't avoid riding on a slippery surface, how should you proceed? Ride in the most slippery part of the lane. Travel as slowly as possible and let your feet skim the surface. Walk your motorcycle across it. Stay relaxed and maintain speed. Answer Travel as slowly as possible and let your feet skim the surface. Question 5. To warn drivers you are slowing down in an unusual place, you can Swerve from side to side Raise slightly off your seat Flash your brake light Shift gears instead of braking Answer Flash your brake light Question 6. What can cause the engine to lock? Not changing gears properly. Skidding the front tire. Braking using only one brake. Being low on oil. Answer. Being low on oil. Question 7. If your throttle is stuck and twisting it does not release it, you should Use the front brake only Pull the kill engine switch Use engine braking Apply both brakes Answer Pull the kill engine switch Question 8 a benefit of riding in the center lane position is it? There is no center lane position. Allows you to turn easily. Keeps you hidden from other drivers. Prevents others from sharing your lane. Answer Prevents others from sharing your lane. Question 9. Why are gravel roads potentially dangerous for motorcycle riders? Lane markings are not present. Gravel provides less traction than pavement. They do not have posted speed limits. Other cars are known to drive recklessly. Answer Gravel provides less traction than pavement. Question 10. It can be dangerous to ride alongside cars because Your visibility will be reduced. You may be riding in their blind spot. It makes it more difficult to operate your motorcycle. You will be distracted by what is happening in the vehicle. 
Answer. You may be riding in their blind spot. Question 11. A way for you to increase your safety at night is to Reduce your speed. Use your high beam. Increase your following distance. All these answers are correct. Answer All these answers are correct. Question 12. When crossing rail tracks, you should cross at a 90 degree angle. In residential and rural areas. At all times. Only when signs tell you to. Unless that path will take into an oncoming traffic lane. Answer. Unless that path will take into an oncoming traffic lane. Question 13. If your motorcycle begins to wobble, the best way to stop it is to. Close the throttle gradually. Apply the front brake. Apply the rear brake. Accelerate out of the wobble. Answer. Close the throttle gradually. Question 14. Alcohol affects the body in many different ways, but the first effect is here. Vision. Reaction. Judgment. Balance. Answer. Judgment. Question 15. When preparing to pass a vehicle ahead of you, you should ride in the lane position. Left. Center. Right or center. Right. Answer. Left. Question 16. The majority of your motorcycle brake power is provided by The clutch By the front and rear brake equally The rear brake The front brake Answer The front brake Question 17. When starting your motorcycle your right wrist should be positioned. Low down, to increase control. High, to use the throttle the most. In the most comfortable position. Flat, so you won't use too much throttle. Answer. Flat, so you won't use too much throttle. Question 18. When is it most important to check your mirrors? All these answers are correct. When you are decreasing your speed. When you are preparing to change lanes. While stopped at an intersection. Answer. All these answers are correct. Question 19. When riding your motorcycle, your feet should be positioned. As far forward as possible. With your toes pointed downward. Firmly on the foot wrists. To drag lightly on the ground. Answer. Firmly on the foot wrists. Question 20. If you are riding over an obstacle on the road, the best way to absorb shock is to Avoid using the brakes. Increase your speed to minimize bumps. Lean back as far as possible. Raise off the seat to absorb shock. Answer 
Raise off the seat to absorb shock. Question 21. If your motorcycle is equipped with a windshield, you are not required to wear eye protection. A helmet is not required. You may wear glasses instead of a face shield. You must still wear goggles or face protection. Answer You must still wear goggles or face protection. Question 22. Proper riding posture means you're All these answers are correct. Knees are against the gas tank. Arms are slightly bent. Feet are firmly on the footrests. Answer All these answers are correct. Question 23. The best way to be seen by other drivers is to Wear a bright helmet. Only ride during the day. Ride in the left lane position. Make sure your headlight is turned on. Answer Make sure your headlight is turned on. Question 24. Your motorcycle chain should be checked. At the start of each season. Once a month. Before every ride is part of the T-Clocks inspection. Once a week. Answer. Before every ride is part of the T-Clocks inspection. Question 25. If your front wheel locks, the best course of action is to Release the rear brake only. Use the rear brake only. Continue applying the brake. Release the brake and reapply it smoothly. Answer. Release the brake and reapply it smoothly. Question 26. The front brake is more important because It provides most of the stopping power. It provides all of the stopping power. It provides less of the stopping power. It is used most often. Answer. It provides most of the stopping power. Question 27. The road ahead looks slippery. What should you do? Slow down before reaching the slippery section. Stop and turn around. Stop your motorcycle and walk it across the slippery section. Use your rear brake only. Answer. Slow down before reaching the slippery section. Question 28. When driving beside parked cars, why is it important to maintain a left lane position? You are more likely to hit a car in the right lane position. Motorcycles should always ride in the left lane position. The center lane position is too slippery. You may avoid problems from doors opening. Answer You may avoid problems from doors opening. Question 29. In order for a passenger to ride your motorcycle, he or she must have their own Seat All these answers are correct. Helmet Footrests Answer all these answers are correct. Question 30. How does carrying a passenger change your motorcycle? 
slowing down will be faster. The motorcycle takes longer to react to changes. They help balance the motorcycle. Passengers make the motorcycle go faster. Answer The motorcycle takes longer to react to changes. Question 31 which of the following is true about drinking alcohol and riding a motorcycle? Motorcycle riders are not permitted to drink any alcohol. Alcohol does not affect motorcycle riders. Alcohol impairs a motorcycle rider's skills sooner. Alcohol affects drivers of cars more than motorcycles. Answer. Alcohol impairs a motorcycle rider's skills sooner. Question 32. Drivers in other vehicles present a particular hazard when You are passing a row of parked cars. You are parking your vehicle. You are driving through a school zone. You are making a right turn. Answer. You are passing a row of parked cars. Question 33. Increase your visibility at an intersection by Riding in the staggered formation Choosing the most visible lane position Coming to a complete stop Looking in your mirrors Answer. Choosing the most visible lane position. Question 34. When you cross railroad tracks, you should ride your motorcycle within your lane to cross the tracks. At a 20 degree angle. By leaning into a side. At a 10 degree angle. Straight. Answer. Straight. Question 35. Which of the following is required for a motorcycle passenger? A helmet. Designated seat room. Passenger foot dress. All of these answers are correct. Answer. All of these answers are correct. Question 36. Because riding a motorcycle is more tiring than driving a car, you should Take frequent breaks. Avoid wearing dark eyewear. Drink caffeinated beverages. Avoid drinking water. Answer. Take frequent breaks. Question 37. What does the SIP Driver Judgment Acronym stand for? Scan, Identify, Predict, Decide, Execute. Scan, Identify, Proceed, Direct, Execute. C. Identify, Proceed, Direct, Examine. C. Identify, predict, decides, examine. Answer. Scan, identify, predict, decide, execute. Question 38. When scanning road conditions, you should be looking for. Road conditions. Escape routes. Traffic conditions. All of the above. Answer. All of the above. Question 39. The best way to protect your eyes is with a three quarter helmet, a face shield, 
eyeglasses, a windshield. Answer. A face shield. Question 40. When should you only use the front brakes? If the back tire is flat. At all times. When you want to stop quickly. On surfaces with low traction. Answer. If the back tire is flat. Question 41. When is important to use your side mirrors? When you are stopped at an intersection. Before changing lanes. Before you slow down. All these answers are correct. Answer. All these answers are correct. Question 42. Because motorcycles accelerate faster than other vehicles on the road, you must Make eye contact with other drivers. Be careful not to run into the vehicle in front of you. Flash your headlights when accelerating. Leave a larger space cushion. Answer. Be careful not to run into the vehicle in front of you. Question 43. The best way to stay alert while riding a motorcycle is to Drive only during the day. Drink beverages with caffeine. Avoid making long trips. Take frequent rest breaks. Answer. Take frequent rest breaks. Question 44. Which brake is more important? The front, because it prevents skidding. The rear, because it prevents skidding. The front, because it provides 75% of the braking power. The rear. Because it provides 75% of the braking power. Answer. The front, because it provides 75% of the braking power. Question 45. While gripping the handlebars, your arms should be positioned. With elbows locked. So they are slightly bent. Anywhere on the handle grips. With elbows at 90 degrees. Answer. So they are slightly bent. Question 46. The best position for traction while reining is? The left lane position. The shoulder of the road. In the tracks left by other drivers. The center lane position. Answer. In the tracks left by other drivers. Question 47. When starting a motorcycle facing uphill, you should change to. To hold the cycle while operating the throttle with the right hand. The foot brake. Both brakes. The hand brake. Either hand brake or foot brake. Answer. The foot brake. Question 48. If your motorcycle begins to wobble, it is important not to. Close the throttle. Grip the handlebars tightly. Accelerate out of the wobble. Adjust your weight. Answer. Accelerate out of the wobble. Question 49. You should use both front and rear brakes to stop. 
at all times. You should never use both front and rear brakes at the same time. On hills and curves. In emergencies only. Answer. At all times. Question 50. When riding through a curve, the most effective lane position is any lane position as long as you maintain it. In the center position is the right lane position. Will change throughout the curve. Answer. Will change throughout the curve. Thank you for watching the video and wish you will get your driver license soon.